Hi everybody, I uh, have some bad news that I wanted to just let everybody know who follows my videos. My uh, crossbeak rooster, Thelmer, has passed away unexpectedly yesterday. Uh, just, I was trying to, um, put him outside and get him integrated with my flock. And he started fighting through the fence with my silky rooster and I came home from work and part of his top beak was missing and he was bleeding and, uh, drooling and I believe there was also damage done to his tongue because he was unable to eat or drink anything. I couldn't even, uh, I couldn't even syringe feed him, so. I had to have the vet put him down. Uh, he was the best rooster that I've ever had. He would just <laughs> lay with me in the sun outside. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to let you know. I know this is a bad video, but I have so many supportive people on this channel who follow everything, you know. And so I realized that he was in with a few of my hens. And so, I could hatch those eggs and actually have part of him still around. Now, please don't, please don't anybody be sending me messages telling me that I shouldn't hatch his offspring because they could be cross beak too. Because if you follow the the stories and, and you watch the video that he's in that I made quite a while ago, I explained that he came from shipped eggs and the circumstances that he was hatched under weren't good and it could have definitely been a humidity issue that caused his cross beak because he also was a shell drager when he hatched and if the shell sticks to them, that is also another sign that the humidity is too high. And my hens don't have cross beaks, so pretty good chance that they'll just be normal chickens. And so I'm going to, uh, I'm going to head outside and see if those hens have hatched or, um, laid eggs today and I really hope that they have obviously um and then I'm gonna do un <laughs> I'm gonna get myself together here first of all and I will do another video about egg hatching tips as far as incubation goes it's tough I miss them I miss him. Yeah, I know. Some people are just going to say it was only a chicken. Yeah, I get it. But, um, hard to find a rooster with such a great temperament like he had. Such a sweet guy. Beautiful. Beautiful rooster. So, um, I just wanted to share with you what happened and I'll go see if there's eggs out there. <laughs> 